sisters with few fears and great ambition, ready to take on the world one ocean at a time. Welcome to another episode of Sailing Far Side. Mm -hmm. um, so this week we finally leave Nassau. Uh, we got all of our, most of our boat projects done, as you know. Mm -hmm. It's not always, it's never done. No. in the front. We head out of Nassau and we make a quick pit stop and uh, do some really cool exciting diving. We stopped at a place called Shark Spot and if you continue watching you'll see why. They smell fear, girls. Yeah. Do they come this close to you? <laughs> do, 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 do. Yeah. Three. Go. We both have to go at the same time. All right. Okay. One, two, three. three. Slow. Thank <laughs> you. 
After diving, we finally made our way to Staniel. Uh, it was a pretty easy trip. Not much wind gave me a chance to uh, fly our drone, but <laughs> as you'll see, it didn't go so well. Did not. Great go. shots, but was it worth it? You'll find out. <laughs> Calm before the storm. Oh. Hi Freya, hi Lulus. Where are the fishies? Look at that, this is insane. Look, I know. So, we're in about 20 feet of water and it is steak. It is just crystal. Look at that. Oh hey, look. Boat. Oh no, it's a race! Papa, look, it's a race! We're racing! We're racing another boat! We're beating them by at least two feet! <laughs> we're, we just swam with the sharks. Amazing! It was honestly it was one so of the coolest cool. things. Oh my god. It was one of the Anyone things. in NASA, you can see the shark. And you just jump in. You yeah. don't have to jump in. Sharks come around. It's marked on the Navionics map as shark site. You have to go. Just north, yeah. right off the ledge, you have to go. It's amazing. And at first, you're going to be super scared, but just jump in. And tip if you want them to come up and swim towards you, just hit the water because it's kind of like you're feeding them. Don't get, they get a little uh, feisty, but um, you, you'll be fine. <laughs> super cool, cool though. And then sit on the bottom, and the nurse sharks will come up to you, and you'll just have like a whole the little, oh, like, the little pups, they yeah. like having their backs scratched. Mm -hmm. But we're on our way to Shroud. And Just for the, the night. night. And then on to Staniel. <laughs> oh, you did it! Just crash land it. Ah! Oh no.
And then we had a beautiful sail down to, we actually stopped in Wardrick Wells for the night. So mm -hmm. we had a beautiful sunset, great sail, made a little snack along the way. Yeah, Sasha's, uh, she's trying to start her own cooking show. So uh, let us know what you guys think. <laughs> yay or nay. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, yeah. <laughs> done the sail before so we feel pretty confident in um, sailing on the banks in the evening so we're gonna we're our heading right now is to shroud and from there we'll veer further south just there's a shoal that we have to avoid on our way down and then also around 9 10 o'clock tonight the wind is gonna start to pick up a little bit more so by the time we reach shroud there's a, a front coming through which, which is bringing in some pretty nice east winds so we'll be sailing down to Staniel and pick up an extra knot and half two knots from there. So that's our sail plan. And uh, tomorrow morning we should be in Staniel off of Big Major. So very excited. Can't wait to get back there. So we're underway to Staniel and uh, just as a little sailing activity. I'm going to use a cabbage and make some coleslaw and I'm going to show you guys how we do it here on the boat. We actually got this recipe from one of our good friends, Renit, Mark and Renit from last year that we met in West Bay. And uh, it's just super, super yummy and we really like it. And so I'm going to make it. So first, of course, you need some cabbage. So next, you're going to slice this up into slight into pieces and um, we'll go from there. Also, I'm not a chef, so if any of this looks really bad, I apologize in advance and my little sister's probably gonna yell at me after watching this. I'm gonna try not to cut my fingers off. Okay. So what we do with the cut up pieces is we put it in the bag. Found this is the easiest way. Okay, so we also have some green cabbage. So I'm gonna add a little bit of green cabbage in there as well. Um, as you can see, I cut up the rest of what I was going to. The red cabbage, I don't know why it's called red cabbage, it's purple. Um, and then I'm gonna cut some of this up, put it in here, right back. Okay, so once you have all the cabbage cut up, as you can see, I cut up some red cabbage, I cut up some green cabbage. Um, now you have to tenderize it, kind of break it up, allow that moisture to escape from the vegetable. Kind of like with eggplant, you wanna sprinkle salt over it to draw the moisture out, it cooks better. Cabbage, you wanna crinkle it up. So what you're gonna do is just have some fun mashing it, breaking it all up. this a little bit. Oops. Maybe I'll do it with my hands. Skin in there and break it all up. You'll feel it start to get a little more moist in there. So, add a little bit of white vinegar. White vinegar. Oh, never mind, got it. So I don't actually know the real recipe. I kind of forgot. 
So I'm gonna play it by ear. So sprinkle a little bit of a distilled white vinegar in there. Forgot what that does, but it does something. I think it does something with the breakdown of the. I'm just gonna shake that up real fast. Okay, so now after you have all the olive oil and the white vinegar all mixed in there, you can see it's you can see it's softening up. So by by breaking it up, it softens it up. Now it's for the fun part. You can pretty much add whatever you want. Um, I'm gonna add a little bit of onion, some dried up apricots, some cranberries. Um, yeah. Oh, some mayo, got some classic avocado mayo. So I'm gonna add that all in. First I gotta cut it all up into small pieces. Without cutting my fingers off. So Ron almost did that today. That hurt a lot. I don't know if you can see, it's not very good lighting. Let's see. I don't know how to cut an onion. Okay, now lastly, I'll put some mayo and Dijon mustard in here. So, grab a spoonful or two mayo. Put a bunch of Dijon mustard. Dijon mustard. And now, Time to mix it all up together. Sasha fail. Don't do it with air. Let the air out. And then you can massage it all together. I think having air in it though at first helps mix it initially. And now you can just like finish mixing it all together. This is why a plastic bag is nice. Yum. Now you put it in the refrigerator, wait a few hours, and eat it. Gotta love cooking while underway. Cooking some fresh veggies from the Ch -ch Chia Farms. Definitely did not say that right. Don't quote me on that. It's the Ch 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 Got some fresh veggies. Making some fresh veggies. I'm gonna make some fake mashed potatoes. Lazy. And some vegan sausages because they're really yummy. Entering the land of the mega yachts. <laughs> the far side is not one of them, but she is. Hello, Staniel Key. All right. We're gonna anchor right over the, by those boats over there. Got some friends over there. Uh, some friends on Not a Clue. Some other boats. Hopefully, we'll be running into some. Fun folks. Here in Staniel. <laughs> that was our sail down from Nassau. Where we lacked in sailing, we made up for it with excitement. And uh, hopefully you guys thought so too. Please like, share, subscribe. Mm -hmm. and subscribe in this corner down here. Uh, we, we appreciate you guys all for watching and following along on our adventure. Yes. Again, um, check in every week. We post our videos at Thursdays at 5 p.m. So for mm -hmm. those of you who are new to watching our channel, check us out every Thursday at 5. 
And uh, so we decided that bloopers added a lot to our videos, but we decided to only show them to Patreon. So if you would like to check out our bloopers, which are pretty entertaining, uh, click on our Patreon link. Down in then, the description. And then you'll be able to watch those every week. Yep. So every week, funny bloopers. We can be kind of entertaining. Yeah. <laughs> or at least we think so ourselves. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, anyways, thanks again for watching. I hope you enjoyed this week's episode. Again, this is Sasha and Natalie on, on Sailing, Sailing the Far Side. Side.